What is up? What is going on, guys? It is your boy Tropical Initial, and this morning we are making Habs preview. Uh, usually, I do Habs lineup. Uh, I did that all preseason long, cause uh, yeah, um, the lineups were different every day. But like, it's kind of similar all the time, so it gets boring. So I'm just gonna start making videos, morning of games, talking about the lineup, yeah. But also about the news surrounding the Canadians, making my predictions for the game and all that stuff. So yeah, new stuff and on the channel. I hope you guys will like it. And yeah, I made some like objectives yesterday and it worked out pretty well. So yeah, let's hit 150 likes. We did 100 yesterday like it was nothing. So right now, I want 150 likes. So if everybody on this video smashed the like button, it could be really really easy and it also helped me grow the channel so take two seconds and like the video and if you're not subscribed already please hit the subscribe button like 60 percent of people watching are not subscribed so i'm on road to 2000 subscribers before the end of the year and that would help me a lot lot so yeah Tonight, the Canadians are facing the Dallas Stars at the Bell Center. Uh, the Dallas Stars are a pretty, pretty good team. Um, yeah, they're a pretty good team. They are um, in the Western Conference. Uh, they have a lot of good players. They have uh, Joel Pavelski. They have Jason Robertson. And the Canadians I have been surprisingly good this year. They beat up the, the Maple Leafs. They beat up the Penguins. Yes, they won against the, the Coyotes. But uh, they beat some really good team as well. And um, the Dallas Stars are three wins and um, one uh, lost in OT. So it's going to be a hard game. They are first in the Central Division in front of the Colorado Avalanche. When, with what last games played. Uh, so, yeah, it's going to be an interesting game, a really difficult game, a really good test for the Canadians with a really good Dallas Star team. Uh, so, yeah, a lot of things happened this morning. Uh, there were also really good games yesterday by Philip Machar and Owen Beck, but I'm going to talk about it in separate in a separate video. If you don't want to miss that out, turn on the bell. So, yeah. Let's get back on my PC. So, yeah, I, I retweeted some stuff um, here. Uh, so, yeah, first thing, Joel Ar Armia uh, and Edmondson have begun the next phase of their rehab. They're practicing with the team right now. They haven't been cleared to play yet. So, first non-contact practice for Joel Edmondson since his injury. Same thing with Joel Armia. I don't really care about Joel Armia, but Joel Edmondson is kind of nice because the games are going to start to be a lot tougher and we need to get this veteran presence on the blue line. So, he could come back faster than we thought. And really good news for that. Joel Armia, I don't really like Joel Armia and we all, we all know that. But, uh, yeah, good news for him because it sucks to be injured. And I'm happy that he's getting healthy. But uh, not my favorite player on the team. So, yeah, Canadians line this morning. Caulfield, Suzuki, Monaghan, Dodden of Dvorak, Gallagher, Drew and Doc Anderson, and Pitlick, Evans, Offman. Yeah, pretty much the same lineup. Gouli, Savara, Aris, Kovacevic, Jakai, Weinman, and Hallen with Montembeau as a backup. And y'all are probably like, where the hell is Slavkovsky? He played his best game last night, scored his first goal, and he's getting scratched. Well, he's not really getting scratched. The Canadians said also that Uri Sofkowski is day-to-day -day with an upper body injury. He is injured. Is it linked to the hit he got from Josh Brown? Maybe, maybe. That was a pretty high hit. Is he? Uh, does he have a concussion? That's possible. Uh, is he injured? Uh, his neck... Uh, his, his hands, I have no clue, but like when a young guy like him with all the forwards you have is injured, you just remove him out the lineup and you let him rest. Uh, he's going to 100% be coming back when he's going to get healthy, but it's better not to play him and not risk anything. So I really like that move from the Canadians. Maybe he's going to play next game. It's just to be safe and yeah. He's not scratch. He's just injured. All right. So everyone calm down. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, um, the Canadians, I think, I think that they will, I think that they will lose this game. Every time I say they lose, they win. So I'm going to keep on with that. We have the red lights 
still on because they're on a winning streak but if they lose we turn out blue that's how it works on this channel if you're new i really need a fripping haircut man this is disgusting to watch uh yeah so yeah i say i say five three five three for the dallas stars they are really good offensive um yeah really good offensively they're really good uh, as a team, they have good chemistry. Joe Pavelski, Ropey, Ince, and Jason Robertson are one of the best line in the NHL. They have some good defensemen. Mason Merchment is really good. He's having a really good season so far. Uh, he's top in point for the Dallas Stars. So, yeah, I think that they're going to wait to, to make the Canadians lose their first game at home this season. But I wouldn't be surprised either if the Canadians take the W. So I say 5-3 for the Stars um, with an empty netter. It will be 4-3. And then they will, uh, the Abs will remove Allen. And then um, Merchment is going to score an, an empty netter. I say one goal for Rupe Hintz. One goal for Tyler Seguin. He, every time he scores against the Canadians. Um, one goal from Robertson. Uh, a goal from Merchment on a empty net. And let's say, let's say, let's say a goal from Nils Lundqvist, man. Let's say a goal from Nils Lundqvist. And for the Canadians, I say Caulfield with two goals. And Jake Evans with this first of the season. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I, I can see a possibility where Caden Goulet scores his first goal tonight as well. So, I don't think, I, I don't put him in my prediction. But be aware of Caden Goulet. I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if he scored a, his first goal tonight. We can see we can see it coming the way he plays. So, yeah. Prediction, maybe. Caden Gouley gets his first tonight. All right. So, let, all right. Let's say Caulfield one goal, Evans one goal, and then Gouley one goal. All right. So, yeah. Let me know what you guys all think. Give me your prediction in the comments below. It's been your boy Tropical NHL. And I'll see y'all later today for another video. Have a nice rest of your day. Bye-bye. <laughs>